The Dreamcast is one of my all-time favorite video game systems, but lately playing it on modern TVs just doesn't really work out that well because the old way of connecting those consoles to TVs just seems a little bit muddied and washed out. But now, a company called Retrobit is producing brand new VGA boxes that honestly make the image sharper than it's ever been. Let's take a look at this. The Dreamcast never really caught on when it was originally released, but some of the best games ever created on any Sega platform reside on that system. And honestly, some of those games were never released on any other platform ever, like the original Shenmue, which is a fantastic game. And the best way to play them nowadays is to still play them on a Dreamcast. But unfortunately, because of the way that the Dreamcast outputs images, it only does it from the basic connector of an RCA. Now that kind of sucks, because RCA outputs aren't very high quality, and well, I'm not a big fan of them. Mostly because the image is going through one little yellow cable that never really performs as good as something like HDMI. Back in the day, they didn't have connector ports like that, but what they did have was S-Video. Now this box here not only does RCA, but it also does an S-Video output that actually looks a lot better than just your basic yellow output from an RCA cable. Now I gotta say, I compared both images side by side, and the S-Video always looked better time and time again. But if you really want to get the best possible image out of your Dreamcast using this box, you gotta use the VGA. The VGA output is simply the best, sharpest image you're ever going to get out of a Dreamcast. Coming in at 640 by 480 this image is one of the sharpest you're going to ever find. And not only is it really sharp, but the colors are also a lot better as well. The VGA input is supported by a lot of monitors and TVs out on the market. Just check behind your TV for a little blue thing and you might actually see that you have one. And if you do, and you have a Dreamcast, you're probably going to want to pick one of these up because believe me, it's going to make your Dreamcast games look a lot better than they've ever looked before. The one issue you're going to have with exporting from VGA on this box is that it does export the image to the VGA cable, but it doesn't export the audio. So really the only way to capture the audio is through a 3.5 inch audio jack just beside the VGA cable right here. Now this is good because you can actually export this into a regular RCA out, or you can put it into your TV if it supports 3.5 inch input, which it might. I know my TV did, but a lot of TVs out there may not actually support that. So just make sure that you have the right cables and you'll be able to listen to the audio and honestly, it sounds just as good as the RCA output on a basic Dreamcast output. We wanted to run a comparison between all forms of output that this box could provide. So we tried out RCA, S-Video, and VGA with a number of games. The first game we tried out was Power Stone 2. Now as you can see in this intro sequence, the VGA output simply looks a lot better than the other two. Although S-Video is really good, you can tell that the RCA output is just muddy compared to the other two output methods. The next game we tested out was Sonic Adventure 2, and as you can tell, the VGA output just looks so much better compared to the other two methods. But still, S-Video is not that bad. So remember, take a look in the back of your TV to see if it supports S-Video, because if you can't get the VGA to work, well, S-Video is a quick second. And last but not least, we took a look at one of my favorite games ever, Shenmue. Now Shenmue is one of the best looking games on the Dreamcast, and the VGA pushes it well out in front of the RCA original output. This right here is the best way to play Shenmue, in my opinion. So if you're going to play Shenmue at any point, you got to play it with this VGA cable, because honestly, it makes a big difference. In the original RCA output, this character's hair kind of blends together, but with the VGA output you can see every individual strand. That's awesome, because I personally never saw that much detail when I originally played this on my TV back when this game came out. Overall, the Retrobit VGA box is a recommended buy from me, simply because if you're a fan of Dreamcast and you've got VGA output that works on one of your televisions or monitors, you simply gotta get this thing. It just looks amazing, and it makes those old Dreamcast games look modern like they just came out yesterday. Now, buyer beware though, not every Dreamcast game on the market actually supports VGA output, so just do your research online before you get the thing so you can play some of your favorite games, and I promise you, you're gonna love this thing.